Hey everyone, this is GM Rex here. Um, as you can tell by my voice, I still don't really feel good. Um, but I wanted to do a review on the um, airplane, well, the airport set in uh, from the Captain America Civil War Legos. So I'll do the minifigures last. Um, don't mind the tissues, I'm still under the weather. I'll start with the uh, little cart here. Yeah, luggage cart. It's got a car trailer attached to it. Three little briefcases. Um, this one says Sokovia. So we got a Sokovia one. We got. Honda, which is where Black Panther's from, Sokovia is from uh, where Scarlet Witch is from, and this last one here just says uh, BLL, it's got a little guy's face and a little triangle, um, so some little easter eggs there in the briefcases, um, next we'll go with the uh, tower, I guess, right there, uh, it's all put together, you got a little do not, you got a little no entry, a uh, gate here, you got some little crates, um, there might be some little easter eggs on the crates too, I think one or two of them has it, uh, so let's look at this one here, uh, Stark Industries, Priority, um, Iron Man reference, obviously. Uh, this one's AIM. So, AIM was in um, Iron Man 3. Uh, so, we'll see what happens there. Um, and this one says uh, Hammer. I think that's a reference to that other guy in Iron Man 2. I'm trying to get the damn thing to focus here. There we go. <laughs> oh, this thing doesn't focus well. Um, I think it's because it fell out of my pocket one day. Uh, it fell out of my pocket on Tuesday. I think something's been wrong with it kind of since then. Well, I, I played around with the settings, so I might have gotten rid of it. But yeah, the set's here. Um, you turn it around here. You got... Let's focus here. A little Ant-Man. Uh, fire extinguisher and such. All that. And the computer and a coffee mug. And here you got a little spinny chair. Lights and all that. Um, then you got an Avengers jet. Don't know if it's the Quinjet just under a different color. Because I got the Quinjet up here and it's a lot bigger. Um, it's kind of like a miniature Quinjet, but it's still pretty big, I mean, yeah, let me get Iron Man over here, you know, he, um, it didn't have some of the pieces for this part right here, so I had to improvise and find some extra pieces, but yeah, you know, it's, someone could fly in there, um, You know, you know, you got the Iron Man figure right here. A whole new design on the chest and stuff and whatnot. Um, we got Sharon Carter, Agent 13. We have Captain America himself. For all the movies named after him. Uh, we got the Winter Soldier. Who else? Scarlet Witch. I like the little flaps um, for her jacket that they did. Um, I thought that was pretty cool. They used a different hair mold than the Age of Ultron one. Um, you know, this is her new outfit she wore at the end of Age of Ultron, you know, when she officially became an Avenger. 
Uh, we got War Machine here, who's not all gray this time. He's all black with a silver face. And there's Rhodey uh, underneath there, obviously. Never got the Iron Patriot one. I wanted it, but I might check Amazon at some point for him. Uh, hell, if I have to buy a, another copy of Lego Marvel Superheroes just to get it, I'll probably do it. Um, or if they make one, which is doubtful. Um, and then I'm going to review here. Well, not review, but you've already seen the Giant Man, you know. I think my nephew watched that video ten times, uh, Austin. And he kept telling me how cool it was and all that. <laughs> it was pretty nice. It was pretty funny. Um, but yeah, I already did something on that. And Grimace was here, but he's not allowed in the room right now because tried biting me earlier today for no reason. Uh, now on top of him I put another I put an extra Ant-Man minifigure well tiny figure micro figure whatever you want to call it uh, I put one of those on top of him uh, you know it looks you know it's kind of like the Dragon Zord with the Green Ranger and Mighty Morphin Power Rangers you know he stood atop the Dragon Zord's head and just kind of reminded me of that. <laughs> uh, all in all, I mean, the set was like 80 bucks. So, if you got 80 bucks and you're a fan of Marvel and Legos, you know, I, I would green light it. Um, you know, all the minifigures look great. Uh, tons of detail on the backs and stuff. Um, I mean, some of the lower bodies are all just plain colored, but like, uh, she's just got all black legs, uh, She's got, like, the jean colors. Winter Soldier's got black. Uh, Captain America's got the dark blue. Um, but, yeah, I would green light it, mainly because of this. This is just so cool to me. <laughs> um, you know, and my nephews, Austin and Caden, thought it was really awesome, too. So, um, you know, I'm going to take this one off. There. But, yeah, this is, like... You know, might the price might seem a little steep, but there are other sets like uh, Joker Land over there was like what 130, um, but it was well worth it for me, um, not because of the Starfire and Beast Boy, but just because I love Joker themed stuff. You know, like a evil amusement park. Uh, I feel like I have to sneeze. <laughs> I'm gonna hold it in. Uh, I drank some Tabasco sauce just a little while ago to kind of hopefully clear my sinuses, but it did no, it did nothing. Tabasco sauce does nothing. Then again, it was only this tiny little bottle here from a tiny little bottle here from an MRE pack. Um, I had I drank one of these last night, the whole bottle, and I felt so much better. Um, I'm starting to sweat, so I think my fever's breaking. Uh, so, but I drank a whole one of these today because I did yesterday, and I felt great afterwards. Today I did it, and nothing happened. <laughs> but I told you I'm going to record anyways. Um, tomorrow is going to be the finale for now for Mockiatry Monday. Um, you know, I just I did two episodes. It, it was fun, but it just didn't work out the way I wanted it to. Um, maybe you know, if you want to do your own Makaiatry Mondays or whatever, go for it. Um, just you know, tell everybody where it originated. <laughs> that would be nice. Um, I'll do a finale for it tomorrow for the time being, and if I get better ideas as time goes on, I'll do it. Uh, so yeah. I'm going to wrap this video up, um, but before I do, I'm going to mention that I'm going to review one of the other Civil War sets tomorrow. I built it this morning. Um, I pulled an all-nighter building this one and one of the other ones. Uh, <laughs> I think I went to bed at like 8 in the morning because I was just building them. Uh, I went into build mode, uh, but yeah, I'm going to review one of the other ones tomorrow. Along with the Malkiatry Monday finale. And then Tuesday, beside the Q&A Tuesday, 
I'm going to do another review on the other one, so I'll have to build it before then, which I will, because it's a small set. It takes, like, no time at all for me. Um, all right, so I'm going to wrap this one up. So like this video, comment, subscribe to my channel, like my Facebook fan page, and I will see you all later.